What do I really think about Sonic 06? I feel like I should probably talk about this because I feel like it's not obvious that my love for Sonic 06 is a joke on this channel. Mostly. I do like Sonic 06 for the most part. There's aspects of its story I happen to enjoy. The soundtrack is probably one of, if not the best, soundtracks in the series, coming after Sonic Unleashed or Frontiers of course. Although I don't know if I'd rank his world after Endless Possibilities or the other way around. But to be honest, I think I'm gonna let Sonic Twitter off that discussion. Huh? Hello? Oh. Uh Sonic Twitter has already debated that? Oh well, that's fine. Uh, thanks for letting me know. Weird. Anyway, as I was saying... Actually, what was I saying? Oh yes, things that I like about Sonic 06. 06 arguably has my favourite characterization of Shadow. In fact, I would go as far as saying that Sonic 06 was the last time Shadow had a good storyline. You know, before, before the dark, dark times. times. Before- ah! Just kidding. <laughs> I mean, Sonic Boom Rise of Lyric wasn't that bad. Right? Look, ramps! We can use these as ramps! Fuck you too. Anyway. In Sonic 06, Shadow visibly cares about his friends. We see this with how he treats Rouge and Omega. I mean, hell, he even saves Rouge. I mean, to be honest, I would also save a bat with Big... Anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. When Shadow essentially says fuck off to Memphis, Tennessee, I mean Mephilus, when Mephilus says that humanity will eventually turn on Shadow again. It's obvious where Shadow stands because of how much he's learned to trust again after the events on the Ark. And what Sonic 06 video could be made without possibly mentioning everyone's favourite future saving hedgehog? Oh, uh, what's that? A Sonic 06 video can be made without mentioning him. Oh, no. No, I'm gonna! Sonic 06 introduces Silver the Hedgehog, a hedgehog who was trapped in a hellish future and does everything he can to save it, even if that means attempting to murder Sonic in cold blood. But work is work if there's money involved. Nah, I'm just joking. I've made videos in the past about the way Silver is characterised. See my breakdown of Dreams of an Absolution, for example. You'll know that Silver the Hedgehog is characterised to be quite a tragic character. Enough said. Hashtag Silver deserves his own year. Although, I, like many, I have to agree that Elise is one of the most terrible parts about this game. I mean, her only purpose in 06 is to get captured and captured and captured. <laughs> No, I get what they were trying to do with the You have this entity within you that you cannot let free For God's sake, Elise, we will all die! But telling Elise she can't cry or else she dooms everyone is pretty silly to be honest I mean, I've said this before You're telling me if she stubs her toe, she can't cry? Oh, uh, what was that? Uh, Sonic 06 was apparently retconned Well, I guess she can cry now Okay, Elise, cry me a fucking waterfall, goddammit Oh Apparently it wasn't retconned and is still canon because no one at Sega slash Sonic team has said it isn't. What is actually going on here? I am actually really confused. <sighs> well, I guess that is another conversation for Sonic Twitter. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Look, I don't want any trouble. Obviously, I already know they've probably discussed this many times before. They threatened to sue me. Anyway, with that being said, Sonic 06 has its fair share of pros and cons. It's debatable whether it's worthy of worst Sonic game when, let's face it, Sonic Shuffle exists. Also, Heroes exists. Hello? Would I say Sonic 06 is the best game ever? No, I wouldn't because Unleashed exists. Also, I do hold Frontiers with a high regard. I just have a soft spot for Sonic 06. It's a guilty pleasure. Is it bad? Yes, it has flaws because nothing is perfect. But I think this really begs the question. Why do I like to say that it's a good game? Well, I'm just gonna put it simply. I enjoy how people get so upset about other people saying they enjoy 06. It just fascinates me how some people, and I say some because not everyone is like this, but some people just absolutely tear into people who have a different opinion and it's just wrong. People are all entitled to their own opinions at the end of the day, and there is just no need for it. 
but I want to know. What do you think? Do you think Sonic 06 is as unbearable as people claim it is? Or do you just have a soft spot for it like I do? Let me know in the comment section down below. And that concludes today's video. Thank you for making it to the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like and to subscribe for future Sonic content on this channel. Also, be sure to check out my Ko-fi page. I'm doing Sonic character render commissions there and your support would be greatly appreciated. And of course, be sure to join the community discord to join the discussion regarding the blue speed mouse. And as always, keep on speeding and have an absolutely fantastic day.